friends, my name is Alexis. Welcome to the USA Test Prep Classroom. Today we are going to learn about place value. Place value is how we know what a digit is worth in a larger number. The location of the digit in the number tells us how much the digit is worth. Look at this number. This number is made of the digits 3, 4, and 5. Each number has a different place. The 5 is in the 1's place, the 4 is in the 10's place, and the 3 is in the 100's place. In our classroom, we use blocks to represent the value of each digit. Come on, let's head there now. This is my classroom and my teacher, Mr. Fernandez. Math is my favorite subject and I love learning about place value. When we talk about numbers in the ones place, we use this ones cube. Can you say ones cube? Great, when we get 10 ones cubes, we can make a 10 rod and then the group of 10 is in the tens place. If there is a digit in the tens place, it means there is a group of 10. In our number 345, there are four groups of 10. What is the value of four groups of 10? Can you help me count them to find out? 10, 20, 30, 40. Great job! Four groups of 10 equals 40. When we have 10 groups of 10, we can make 100. We use a 100 flat to show a group of 100. Can you say 100 flat? Awesome job! In our number 345, there are three hundreds flats. Do you know the value of 300 flats? 100, 200, 300. Three flats equals 300. Let's head over to the airport to find out more about place value. I just love to watch the planes take off at the airport. There are so many planes that are leaving today. On the flight board, it says that there are 724 flights today. I am thinking about how I would build that number with my blocks. How many ones cubes do I need? That's correct. I would need four ones cubes. How many 10 rods do I need? Yes. I need two 10 rods. What is the value of my 10s? Correct, the value of the 10s is 20. How many 100 flats do I need? Yes, the number 724 has 700 flats. Let's leave the airport and go to the parking lot. I see that there are a lot of cars in the parking lot. I notice that the cars are parked in rows or groups of 10. I count all the rows and there are 10. I know that 10 rows of 10 cars is the number 100. I could show the number of cars in the parking lot with a 100 flat. Let's head back to the classroom. I had so much fun learning about place value with you today. We learned that the position of a digit in a number helps us to know its value. We also learned that a group of 10 ones is the same value as a 10 rod and a group of 10 10 rods is the same as a 100 flat. Place value is so much fun to learn about. Thanks for your help. See you next time.